look at reality and see what everyone else sees. Take a step back through time and space and understand that life as we know it is nothing more than a constant of motion and sound, light and dark, mass and volume. Time allows life to travel in only one direction, but what if time did not exist? Would your world then configure to your nightmares of your mind, or would it lay flat and allow you to pass by without a single feeling? It can be twisted in any direction in a blink of an eye, or destroy you with a flick of a finger. The only way to truly know is to observe reality from the other side. This is a man. This man has a name. That name is Peter Evans. Peter has generally stayed on the up and up his entire life. He's always tried to do what was right and be nice to people because the planet Earth does not need any more negativity. This is true. But would that still be true if Peter found himself crossing over to the other side? scared right now who just said that I did what the hell this can't be happening oh but it can it is happening I need to warn you Peter so you don't die and become me I'm not having an easy time with this I know you're not remember I was you at one point Okay, so what do we do now? You need to listen to me. After I am gone, you are gonna have a heart attack and die. What? What causes the heart attack? Your heart attack is caused by the knowledge that you're gonna have a heart attack. Well, what the hell am I supposed to do about it now? There is a medical kit under the kitchen sink. In that medical kit is a bottle of aspirin. This aspirin will save your life. Now be quick, go, quick, now. So many poor souls have wasted their lives trying to change the past. Even with the remarkable circumstances given to Peter Evans, he still wasn't able to save his own life. Perhaps life is a preordained set of amount of moments. Or perhaps it is an immovable force that doesn't want to be changed. No matter what, we can be certain that life is not what you think when you cross into the other side. Mm -hmm.